Tonight, Monday Night Raw, live here in the United Kingdom. King, that was a great visit today. We had the beautiful Birmingham Museum. Oh, you embarrassed me. You're not supposed to touch the paintings. Did you put that stuff back you were, you were handling? Most of it. Uh-oh. No chance of that much of Ladies and gentlemen, Ladies and gentlemen business. Please welcome the chairman of World Wrestling Entertainment, Mr. Just picked up. Thank you, Lillian. <laughs> well, tonight, Monday Night Raw is brought to you by Just for Men. Stay in the game with Just for Men hair color. And by Snickers. Most satisfying. Someday they'll have a museum in the honor of Mr. McMahon over here in England. The Mick Museum. The Mick Museum. Uh, that's good. Oh, what how, about, how about in uh, Ireland? I'm probably going to build that. Oh. WWE already have one there. What's this demonstration he's been talking about? Any idea? Oh, but I think we'll you know, out. sometimes I even amaze myself with my own promotional genius. Imagine me, Mr. McMahon, coming up with a concept known as Cyber Sunday. Now, let's face it, Cyber Sunday is a WWE fan's dream come true. Cyber Sunday, it's where you log on to WWE.com and you determine matchups. You determine you determine matchups, you determine stipulations of matches, you determine, quite frankly, the outcome of a contest. Oh. Please don't anger him. And at Cyber Sunday, it'll be Triple H against this man. Ooh, Maga! And the things that Umaga did to the game last week, I thought were absolutely impossible for any one human being to pull off. And well, quite frankly, there weren't, there wasn't one human being. The game had bad ribs coming into last Monday after no mercy, after wrestling in three championship matches. And then the game gets put into a handicap match with that man Umaga and the WWE champ Randy Orton. And yeah. brother did Umaga do, a, do some damage on the game last week. Right well, Triple H, we understand, may have a cracked rib or two after that. It wasn't just Umaga, there were steel steps, there was a steel chair, Samoan spike, everything involved. All at the hands of the Samoan Bulldogs. Now, one of the stipulations that you can choose in this Triple H Umaga match at Cyber Sunday is a street fight, which means, of course, that you can beat the holy hell out of your opponent if you want to, not just with your fist, your entire physique, your, your feet, whatever, but anything you want to pick up around ringside. Quite frankly, it's a brutal, brutal match. And uh, we're about to have a demonstration, as I mentioned to Mr. Regal. What's oh. your name, Kit? Uh, Andy Simmons. Wait a minute, your voice is cracking. What's your name? Andy Simmons. Andy Simmons. Wait a minute, you guys cheer him because his name is Andy Simmons? Or is it because he talks funny? Andy, are you afraid? Yeah. You should be. Ring the bell. Oh, no. Oh. And Andy Simmons. Oh, oh, gosh. You see that shot in the face? Oh, well, Andy, it's time to face your fears. But look at the... The carnage Umaga is just a, is a savage beast. Uh oh, look out. They're coming that, right over in front of us. Look out now. This is a example of a street fight. Oh. And uh, Umaga, this is all legal in a, in a street fight. This is what we could see it at Cyber Sunday. Ref, you might want to come out here. Well, maybe we don't want to come out here. I'd much rather Umaga get back in the ring. This is a dangerous man, this Umaga. He's out of control. He's a... Oh, no, 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 no! Oh, good God! What's wrong with you? What, what is all this about? Oh, come on! Good free! I think somebody should call Andy's next to Ken.
back on the air here with Margaret destroying our equipment. Looks like he's destroying Andy Simmons. I don't know if I'm back on or not. <laughs> and look at this. A the tear, the steel tear, oh, and the Samoan drop. More carnage. And mercifully, this assassination and is over. Umaga. Wow. All right. That, we got the point of the demonstration. We got the point, all right. Umaga destroying equipment, human bodies, and that's exactly what Umaga wants to do at Cyber Sunday when he meets Triple H. Washington, D.C. will never be the same. Get him out of here. Not much in the way of competition, I can tell you that. Not much that's in what's going to happen in the street fight. Bunch of the way of uh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Man. Whoa, 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 hang on a second. Hang on! You know, there's, there's another stipulation these people can choose at Cyber Sunday, and that's, that's called a first blood match. Uh -oh. no. That's pretty simple. The winner of the first blood match is simply the man who draws first blood on his opponent. I think we're about to have another demonstration. Throw him back in the ring. Oh, come on. Get in there. That's as cruel and unusual punishment. This is not. Get in there, Ralph. Get. This young Ring man. The bell. Ring it. This young man is absolutely can't even defend himself. Well, this is what Mr. McMahon says is going to happen to Triple H. Man, man that Cyber Sunday. Uh oh. Umaga taking a run, 350 with oh! a headbutt. That's going to leave a mark. That's definitely going to leave a mark. Huh? This is unconscionable. This is Umaga is just looking at at this young man, this young Brent, like he was like he was Triple H at Cyber Sunday. And Mr. McMahon certainly enjoying the view, but oh, good grief! That's a runaway double-decker bus, Samoan style. And man, this young man finish him off. Oh, what a total lack of compassion for Mr. McMahon. Cold and calculating. Oh, finish him off. The Mick motivator. Oh, oh gosh. The Samoan spike to the throat. No, come on! Oh, oh, come on! Get him! Get him! Get him! This is enough! Is enough? For goodness' sakes! And the winner of the first blood match, Umaga. Oh, this poor kid. This poor young man. Man, that is that is absolutely. This kid's awful. hurt. Give me some yeah, medical attention hurt. down here. This kid's hurt. Now that's a revelation. That's sad. Just damn sad. Get him out of here. Oh. What a compassionate man. Get him out of here. We've seen just how much Mr. McMahon despises that the game. That looks nasty. 